everybody, this morning we're going to talk about the PCR test. Please Google this if you can. I know a lot of you want to get out and travel and get on a plane and go visit your relatives. But I think as of this fall, you're going to have to have that star on your driver's license. So, um, forgot the name of it, but that's, that's something I need to do on my to-do list. Um, but the PCR test is a test that lets the airlines or whoever you need to show it to know that, you, that you're that you not infected as of this time within, I think it's 72 hours. And I think a lot of airlines are gonna expect this. I guess it depends on which country you're gonna go fly to, right? Um, a lot of people are coming into my job and asking for the PCR test. And um, yeah, it's a real thing. Now, I don't know if this has ever happened, but if you've gotten both of your COVID shots, why would you need a PCR test? I don't know. That's just something that I guess uh, it will come out in the news or something. I don't know. But a lot of the airlines want to know that you haven't, you you don't have a temperature, you don't have COVID, you know, because when you book the airline or the, the ticket. By the time you get to the airport, you could have contracted it. So I think that's why they want this PCR test. Now, it is different than the COVID test. So don't get them confused. Um, but it, it is a confusing subject, just let me tell you. Uh, it's, yeah, the PCR is a, is a specific test. And, um, yeah. A lot of people are posting a picture of their shot, their COVID shot record on social media. You can't do that because if if um, these scammers and identity theft people, if they know your birthday and your address or some pertinent information and, you know, and they happen to go through your trash and you're not shredding your important mail, they can steal your identity. So don't put it on social media on Instagram or Facebook don't do that you're asking for it someone stole my identity two years ago I don't know how in the hell they did it but I shred everything I sure do they went to um, some place in Florida Walmart and bought a $500 something electronic I have a feeling it was a phone I have a feeling so you can't trust anyone I'm telling you lock up your social security number lock up your date of birth that is very very important you can't trust anyone there's so many drug addicts out there that they they don't have any conscience anymore everything is just about getting their next fix you see so, yeah, please listen to me.